So this is a Honkai Star Rail channel now, and I'm not gonna expand on any further than that. Uh, this is a video on doing my departure walk pool. Uh, pretty much your starter pool that everyone gets to do 50 of. Uh, they cost 40 tickets to do all 50 pools. Uh, you're guaranteed to get a 5 star, and I'm gonna put on the screen which are considered the best ones if you were thinking about re-rolling. Uh, probably Bayou, Bonya, they're the best characters. Personally, I don't really care too much, I'm going to play this game pretty casually. So, in terms of who I'm going to pull for, I'm going to pull for guys that I think look cool. So probably uh, Gepard is probably the guy I'd want to go for. Uh, Yang Ying looks pretty cool. Uh, I don't really want these kid characters, but you know what? 5 stars to 5 stars. So let's just see what I end up with. This game, in terms of gameplay, is actually not too far from One Piece Treasure Cruise. So if you're interested uh, in playing this and wanted like a point of reference, there's like weaknesses uh, that characters are always with you. So it's like team building, having specials. It's not too different so far with the uh, new character. I, I think this is you already get for free from playing the game anyway. So it's actually not a great pull, but uh, dupes is I guess not too bad in this game. Just getting a bunch of, um, I can't even remember what they're called right now. But equips for the characters, nothing too special. Obviously the main thing we'd want is characters. Because that's the only thing that's uh, going to be rare really. All this other crap is probably nigh on useless. But at least I know that I'm going to guarantee to get a 5 star. And uh, whatever I get I'm just going to max it out. Probably because it's going to be better than anything I have. Ooh, I know, that's another <laughs> equip. I'd like to get another 5 star, I don't know when it's guaranteed, but the rates are probably like, ridiculously low, so I'm not holding my breath. To be honest, I have no idea. This is a 4 star, so I'm assuming it might be decent, and I'll probably... Actually, I don't think I have a destruction character right now, so it's pretty useless, but I will definitely obviously pull one at some point. Uh, so far, I'm quite enjoying the game. It's pretty chill. Um, if you've played Genshin Impact, like the overworld, the quests, the like, the way you move around the game is pretty much exactly the same. There's just minor differences. It's not as Breath of the Wildy as Genshin Impact. Oh, alright, this is much though. A dupe, I guess. It's not bad. You get to level up her character. Might be useful because I'm assuming that he, since she's a main character, he's gonna kind of be forced into your pie at some point. So. It's not bad to have a dupes of her, I guess. Obviously, I'd like a newer character. I have no idea what any of these things do. I'm not gonna bother looking them up because I'm assuming if they're three stars, they're pretty much garbage. So, no five stars, but uh, there's definitely gonna be one in the last one, so let's see if this penultimate one is gonna have anything good. Oh, we'll start to start. Garbage, garbage. Ooh, another four star. Maybe that'll be good on uh, March 7. It's like the worst name for a character I've ever heard. Got like a million of these hidden shadows. And ethereal, meditation. Great, great. I mean, the, the art style and graphics in this game are actually pretty top notch. And I got no complaints there. And I got two four stars, nice. And now finally we'll get our five star. Uh, like a Gepard, I uh, like Yay. Uh, just, just not the characters, please. I, I just, just hate the look of them. Which means that's what I'm gonna get, but let's see. Oh. Garbage. See, Shang got a new character? I can't complain about that. I think I got did I get one or two new characters, actually no. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Oh. God damn <laughs> it. To be fair, I think she's actually supposed to be top tier in this game. I just uh, I hate kid characters. But you know, it's an OP character supposedly like for now, so I'm probably gonna save up uh my gems or whatever they're called. Pulls for like the premium ones for someone I actually think it's cool. But I guess she'll hopefully be able to carry me in the early game. Right. Oh, she comes at level 80, which means she's already 
so OP for my team of like level 20s. So, yeah, this is actually kind of ridiculous to take. Oh, right, no, okay, never mind, that was just a preview. Uh, this game literally came out yesterday. Yeah, I'm sure there's like a lot of information found up from like the base and stuff, but like, I'm pretty much playing this game blind. Then, nice. Nice. I'm just gonna send now. I literally hit level 15, which is the point where you can do your walk pulls. And as I said, if you want to reroll, that's probably the best time to try and do it. So much stuff to like sit through, and to be honest, you're probably just gonna use an abundance. They already sorted out, yeah. I don't have a look at which one's actually useful for. Just basic attack. I just go with this for now. I'll just sort it out later. But yeah, those are my warp pulls. I think nothing out of the ordinary, pretty standard. Just get one five star, but the fact that I got probably like the best one right now, it's pretty nice. Uh, might do some more content on Honkai Star Rail, see how I feel. Uh, but uh, yeah, so far it's a pretty cool game. Uh, if you did your warp pulls, uh, just put them in the comments below. If you got anything interesting, if you got anything like out of this world, but yeah, that's it for now. See you later.